Hey guys, just wanted to bring you a quick important update on CASPA. As always, make sure that you hit the thumbs up button, that you drop a comment, and you click that bell icon for all notifications to know when I go live each and every single weekday for my daily live stream, all in the charts where I take your TA questions. Of course, you can find me on Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, and TradingView at CryptoBullGod. So here we see that back in December, early December of 2022, uh, there was 1 million CASPA that was raised to support the development of a Ledger uh, CAS app, which is really important because we need to understand as individuals who are invested in the cryptocurrency space that self-custody of our assets is critical. It is absolutely critical. I have several hardware wallets, including Ledger. I have a Nano X and S. Um, so I've been waiting personally for Caspa to be available on my Ledger wallet so that I can uh, self-custody my assets. So here we see that there was a development uh, stage to um, get this app going for Ledger. And next we can see that in May, early May, the Ledger integration was finished. It was tested and submitted for Ledger to review. Okay, so this happened five months later in terms of being submitted to Ledger. So the question is, okay, well, we're now fast forward. We're, you know, at time of recording, it is September 12th of 2023. This is four months later. Where are we at? I mean, that's really what I was wondering myself. And so I, I reached out on the 10th, two days ago, uh, to Ledger and said, how much longer until this is supported? And you can see, um, got a lot of bots and spam replying to me, but Ledger support was kind enough to reply to my tweet. And they said, hello there, we're excited to let you know that a CAS app is in the works. Although we can't give you an exact launch date just yet, you can bet that we'll make a big announcement as soon as it's ready to roll out. Your patience in this matter means a lot to us. Now, I did reply to this. Um, I thanked them for replying and said I was very much looking forward to the announcement. Early to mid fourth quarter of 2023, fingers crossed. I believe based on the time that this thing was submitted in May, unless if there is something unanticipated that is discovered, um, and also based on the fact that they gave me a reply here, um, I'm really heavily leaning towards this being available uh, during the fourth quarter. During the fourth quarter of this year, sometime between October, November, and December. Uh, and again, my hope would be that it would be early to mid uh, fourth quarter, sometime between October to the middle of November. So we'll have to keep our eyes peeled there. But let me also point you to something else that I want you to keep on your radar. Now, I've, I've mentioned uh, to all of my audience that I've been purchasing all of my CASPA through Uphold. CASPA was made available uh, via Uphold to the community beginning at the beginning of May. It's been four months, pretty much exactly four months, actually, that CASPA has been available on Uphold. Now, given that I've been purchasing my CASPA on Uphold, we know as of today that you can't send and receive CASPA on Uphold. And I know a lot of people uh, have a lot of different opinions about this, but I want to bring also your attention to CASPER, ticker symbol CSPR. This was another project that was made available on Uphold, and a lot of people were disgruntled over the fact that they couldn't send and receive CASPER. They couldn't get it off Uphold to self-custody. There is technological infrastructure that needs to be built to allow for that. You need to understand that Uphold uh, is sort of considered an exchange, but really they are a point of contact. I, I almost think of them as a third party, to be honest, um, that basically interacts with various exchanges to allow you to get the best price possible. Um, they try to get the best price price possible for uh, for purchases and sell and sells of cryptocurrencies okay so the infrastructure that needs to be developed to allow for onboarding and offboarding of a project is different and we saw with Casper 
that they eventually built that infrastructure to allow you to onboard and offboard Casper. I am, and I know they're working on this behind the scenes, I believe that the timing of being able to withdraw your funds and being able to onboard funds on Uphold will occur relatively soon. I think this is something that is going to be occurring soon, if not this month, uh, I think by early fourth quarter of this year. And so where I'm going with this is I believe that the timing of the announcement that Ledger, the Ledger app is available uh, for CASPA, as well as being able to offboard your CASPA from Uphold to self-custody, they're all going to be occurring at the same time. And it's going to be a lot of exciting news here that's going to drop by the fourth quarter of this year. And it's, this year, and it's something I want you guys to be very on top of and keep on your radar because it's going to be some exciting news that's going to come in for the Casper community. If we look at price real quick, uh, not much time has passed since my last TA update. You can see that we're getting the price action that I was anticipating. That we're looking at a six-hour time frame here. I was sort of looking at this bull pennant structure. We can see the. Uh, the pole here on the uh, six hour with the pennant looks like we are getting the breakout um, and we're bouncing right up. Now, I've indicated to you guys that 4.3 cent area was going to be a major area of resistance. We want to stay. We want to start to take out this 4.7 cent area that I spoke to in the last video and, and begin to take out these lower highs here. That's when I'll be convinced that we truly are going to be going back into price discovery. You can see on the two day chart here. Uh, some of these price indicators are really starting to pick up. RSI is at 61. Stochastic RSI looks great. And we're going to get a positive cross on this MACD, it looks like, if we continue upwards momentum. This is a chart also that I had posted out there on Twitter. That's why it's important that you follow me on Twitter. I also routinely update you guys on all in the charts, my daily live stream. So make sure you click the bell icon so you receive all notifications. You have to click all notifications to know when I go live for that. Uh, but you can see here, let's get off price indicators. You can see every single time uh, on this weekly chart for CASPA, every single time we've had a candle body close above the 10 simple moving average, which is the blue line. Let me take off the 20 for the moment. The blue line, you can see the time frame and the price appreciation, approximate price appreciation we have got. So I took the average over here and said if, it, if we do something on average, We'd go up about 325%, taking us to 16 cents in approximately 42 days, uh, which would take us out to uh, mid-October. So again, things are getting very exciting for the CASPA community in terms of price and as well as the fact that Ledger has confirmed uh, they're working on it. Again, I believe this is something that's going to take place in early to mid-fourth quarter. I also believe Uphold relatively soon will be announcing that you can offload your CASPA to self-custody. Um, I do know that that is something that Uphold um, wants the community to be able to do for any project. They are literally just an on and off ramp to be able to buy and sell cryptocurrency. It's just a matter of getting that infrastructure in there so that individuals can self-custody CASPA. And I'm confident the team will have that relatively shortly. If you appreciate the content, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, drop me a comment, click the bell icon for all notifications to know when I go live and when I drop videos like this. And uh, share what you liked about the video, what you didn't like about the video. Drop me a comment. So until next time, everybody, let's all spread awareness and let's carry the education forward. So what you gonna do, dollar, or crypto and it's crypto maniacs and the entire